having a good time yeah. I feel like you've been asked that like 10 times and you guys are tired of answering that but you know what you know what even if you're not having a good time that's on you because <laughs> 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 let's you know what let's give it up for all the performers tonight like before me and after me Woo! They're really bringing the, the Christmas spirit and we're feeling it, right? But now it's time for December. Yes, time for what? December. It's time for what? December. Yes, so after tonight, what are we going to do? We are going to drink. What are we going to do? Drink. We are going to? Drink. Even if it's just Fanta and tea, we are going to drink it. Isn't it? <laughs> right, so my name is... Uh, Tanya Alex, and as you heard, I am a comedian. And this week has been a special week because it's, it's my sister's birthday. She was born in December, just in time for the party, like Omicron. <laughs> Delta was doing its thing, you know, killing people with alcohol, sanitizer, right? And Omicron just showed up like, you know what I'm saying. <laughs> um, so it's gonna be a little bit sad, just just a teeny bit, right? But my father passed away when my mom was pregnant with me. First man in my life to stand me up, right? I mean, I showed up. I showed up to the most important day of my life. Okay, looking the best that I could at the time, because it's not easy being born, let me tell you, right? You come into existence in complete darkness, you can hardly hear anything. Nine months later, you're pushed out, it's loud, it's cold, it's noisy, someone smacks your booty for the first time, right? So I was like, whoa, whoa. what the fuck? only to hear the man had ghosted, literally. Oh. But you guys can relax, okay? You guys can relax. Okay, this is not a Tyler Perry movie. We didn't go destitute or anything, right? My mom was smart, she went to school. I respect her hustle. Clap hands for my mom, you guys. Thank you, thank you. So I work hard. Partly because um, she beat the procrastination out of us. But partly because things like this happen where a good parent hits the highway to heaven. Or hell. We don't know what kind of man he was. I mean, don't get me wrong, okay? I've heard only, I've heard only good things about him. Only good things. Like, like he was a rich doctor. Yeah. He was a rich doctor. He was a rich doctor. Yeah. And you know, I know only good things about him and he was a rich doctor and everything, but for all we know, he could have been running an underground prescription drug syndicate, right? And all we hear is good things because he is dead. Because that's what people do, right? When someone dies, we only say nice things as if the moment you say one bad thing that they actually did, they're going to resurrect like the undertaker. 
Just boom. What did you impart? Like, okay. So, mom put us through school, and I went to like a, you know, a good school, top-notch school. So, as you have it, the um, sports captain, right? She is playing for the national hockey team now, right? The top of the chemistry class is now a doctor. The school gossip is a well-traveled journalist, okay? The popular girl is a um, huge influencer now. So from this pattern, you can sort of deduce that I was the class clown, okay? <laughs> Moral of the story is support your children's talents, right? I wish I could even say, <laughs> I wish I could even say the head girl's now the president, Padesh. <laughs> Maybe she overslept and missed the 2017 coup. Oh. <laughs> you know, it's a, it's a little weird now walking around with no mask. Like, I feel, I feel exposed, you know? It's like I'm walking around with, with no pants, just cheeks swinging, <laughs> except on my face. <laughs> and people don't know this, but I feel like these masks are slowly changing our faces, you know? Like, um, when someone hasn't seen you in two years, they'll be like, wow, you're now so tall, you're growing, right? But anyone who hasn't seen you since uh, pre-pandemic now will be like, wow, your ears are really moving forward. <laughs> We now all look like Obama's cousins. <laughs> so earlier on this year, I moved out on my own. I was like, yes, I got this, right? And before I did, I thought I was smart because I got the important things. Like I got a bed, I got a fridge. There's no couch. But you know, the set is nice and I'm tempted to sit there because I'm tired of sitting on the floor, guys. If I was to invite you guys to a party, right? um, so yeah, I got the bed, I got a fridge, I got an iron, I got a pot plant, like an actual plant in a pot, not, not a, you know what I'm saying? I see you stoners, I see you. <laughs> so, I thought, you know, I could afford the other stuff once I was out on my own, like food and curtains. Let me tell you, my neighbors have been watching me like it's Toyota World of Wildlife, okay? No curtains for months, just windows and a wild tanya in her natural habitat, right? Just there, like, see her, devour her staple meal of chingwa chinekovo. <laughs> so, I had to make, I had to make ends meet. So to make ends meet, I had to, I had to, you know, make hard economic adjustments. Like, I only drink coffee and do number two at work now. <laughs> because, yeah. I can't drink coffee when I'm not at work, like over the weekends, because it's gonna make me want to do number two, and I'm not trying to eat into my tissue budget right now. <laughs> it's a little pricey where I'm staying, guys, okay? Because I like nice things, like running water, okay? And it's a little, it's, it, it's sad. It's sad. Water is now a luxury, okay? We're already paying strive and, uh, Mark Zuckerberg all the way in Malibu to talk to each other here, right? Soon, soon we'll be saying, we'll be saying things like, in kumba kwangu kuno dura because oxygen. Okay? There's things that, as a, as a, as a new Muroja, there's things that I don't quite know, right? Like, um, I'm not really sure how much of the yard I can use up. Like, my neighboring tenants are in a cottage, right? So if they want to walk around their house, they walk around the cottage. 
I am in a one room, okay, a bed sitter, and it's part of the main house. So if I want to walk around the house, I have to walk around the whole mansion, right? But something tells me my landlord is going to say, I was sister, Marie, you know, pay it up and up. Um, it's been nice staying alone, it's been nice. I've got freedoms now, like, especially times like now when it's the holiday, right? The endless, you know, the, the possibilities are endless. Like, uh, like tonight, am I gonna go home? Alone? Tonight? This year? Right? No one is there to ask me, like, Wanga ori kupi, wanga o nani. I get nice questions now, you know, like, um, hey, how was your day? Who's your daddy? You know, like, <laughs> did you eat? What's my name? <laughs> and you know what else? You know what else? Okay, the factory needs to go for some test runs before production begins, you know what I'm saying? Mm. So, like, I'm a bit of a flirt, okay? But it doesn't always happen on purpose. It doesn't always happen on purpose, okay? Um, like, one time I was at the supermarket, and you know the two operators' assistants, they're packing the bags, and he's like, shall I put it in a plastic? <laughs> so I'm like, yeah, put it in a plastic. I was about to grab the bag and he's like, wait, let me take you there. <laughs> so I, 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 I don't know, I was like, don't worry, I can, I can take myself there. He was like, um, but it's a big package. Can you handle big packages? I was like, yeah, I can handle big packages, I'm strong. <laughs> and then he's like, oh, where do you want it? I was like, in the car. And then he was like, okay, I'm still at work, but you can leave me a number. And I was like, whoa, whoa, wait, wait, wait. That's, that's not what. Okay, it's also me, 5469, reason Kind of like older guys, you know, because I guess it's a maturity thing. We can be doing a couple things, like roasting each other, right? So I will roast him, he'll roast me, I'll roast him, then he'll start crying. Then I'm the one stuck saying, sorry, sorry, Kami. Chivege zakuchema. Sorry, Dr. Ngirama Bandos. I was sorry. Hakaz Kadiki Nanji Tamba. Okay, that's my time, guys. Thank you very much.